And there he swung with a haymaker. Oh, wow. He's got him right here. Oh, wow. for this welterweight fight. So two years, the gap in age, and they both possess a similar height and reach. Here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Eve Loving. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold-out Bell Center in Montreal, Quebec, Canada. It's time! Five rounds in the UFC welterweight division. Introduce the first. Fighting! This man is a kickboxer, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands 5 feet 8 inches tall, weighing in at 158 pounds. Fighting out of Mexico City, Mexico, fast. And now he's his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands 5 feet 7 inches tall, weighing in at 155 pounds. Fighting out of Los Angeles, California, Bruce the Dragon Lee! Okay, for take yourself at all time will be my command at all time. If you want to touch love, do it now, go back to your corner. I am very fired up for this fight. It's been a long time coming. The fans have been anticipating this for a long time, and it is gonna go down right now. We are ready to go with round one here. Well, what a visual this is. Bruce Lee ready to go for round one, the founding father of modern mixed martial arts. It's hard to simulate his speed and his striking in training. And I think that's something that has been a big focus for the opponent coming in here tonight. Quick with his hands, quick with his feet, and obviously a guy who gets off to a very good start more often than not. Bruce Lee ready to go for round one. Right hook. All right, so here we go with round one. There is no denying just how much power this fighter has in his kick. So let's see how early he chooses to attack with it. Does he go low to the leg? Does he go high to the head? Let's see how the early portions of this fight play out. Oh! This could be it right here. Just out of range with the big right hand. Well, he got his head snapped back by that straight hand there, and he's shown a vulnerability tonight by leaning right into that punch as he tries to set up his own offense. May want to focus on some defense here moving forward. Superman punch now. With that punch, no good. Next there, Joe. These guys are swinging. Just over two minutes to go in the round. Oh, slips the punch there, Joe. Big right hook coming. It's blocked. Tags him with the left. How about that shin? Really threw everything into that uppercut, but fell short. Oh, nice jab by Lee. That one hurt. Joe, pretty good head movement to slip that right hand. 
Misses a huge hook to the head. Look at that nasty jab. Nice kick right there. Oh, he's got it going tonight. Beautiful combination of strikes there by Lee. Oh, he clipped him there. And just misses with that big right hand. Hard hook. That hook sounds means we have reached the end of round one. Let's take a look here. And here's a nice shot lands perfectly. And here's another clean shot that lands. And another perfectly placed strike. The beautiful Jenny Andrade to get us going. Second round here. Starting off this round, you got to think he's probably still hurt from that last round. He's going to want to move and avoid taking damage early. Splits the guard, connects with the punch there, Joe. Back to the body shots now, that one. Well, he's landed some excellent shots in this fight tonight, but more often than not, it has been one and done. So the emphasis now moving forward combinations throw your punches in bunches and really try to force the issue and get your opponent out of there and he's looking for that left well he left his head open there joe and he got cracked with that jab he was almost moving into it so let's see if he can switch up the footwork here joe and make the requisite adjustments spinning back fist just over three minutes to go there's a nice left hand Well, he is really high kick. Oh, he hurt him. He's got him hurt here. The left hook hits home. Oh, a huge block there. Nice leg kick. Lee gets caught with that punch. He's treading water now. Got to find a way to move those feet. Nice. Big kick to the head. He's stunned. He's got him right here. That one appeared to stun him. Back up. And now start to snap off that jab. Oh. Well, not wasting any time working on chewing up that lead leg as he lands his first leg kick of the fight. Under a minute now to go in the round. Effective punch there by Lee. Oh, a nice punch out of the break there after he had caught the leg. So he is really starting to put it all together now and clearly seems to have found the timing of his opponent. 30 seconds now to go in the round. Right hand upstairs. Just missed with the left there. Nice shot. And that's the end of round number two. And there is the horn. Big five minutes for him there. Great round from Lee. Yeah, that knockdown should have won him the round. It was a big moment in the fight. He doesn't want to be there. Here's a vicious kick that results in a knockdown. Let's take a look at that again. And let's take a look at that from a different camera. Thank you very much, Carly Baker. Ready? 
Third round underway. Well, just as he did in the previous round, he continues to connect on a high volume of strikes. And a good sign, too, doesn't seem to be slowing down whatsoever. Lands a punch there, Joe. Looking to avoid that left hand. Roundhouse kick lands. We show you the total strikes. Punch coming, it's blocked. Almost in range with the straight left, but that's a miss. How about that chin? Well, the right hand has been there at times, not that time. Oh, he's really starting to apply pressure on his opponent here. Different approach here in the last couple rounds, and it's the exact sense of urgency that you want to see from a fighter take the judges out of it. Hit him with the Superman punch. So we have passed the midway point in the fight. Inside leg kick is good. Nice jab. Well, so again, the uppercut lands, and again, it's because he failed to move his head. I don't want to take all the credit away from the offense, but he is leaving a lot to be desired here defensively tonight. Right hook to the head, blocked. Beautiful timing with the left hand. Again, he's looking for that left. It's not there. Oh! 30 seconds to go. Oh, nice jab. Clean punch. And that'll do it. 15 minutes in the books. And that's what started everything off, that beautiful jab. And here's another punch that sneaks through. And here's another perfectly placed punch. Really excellent striking being displayed in that round. Carly Baker in the building tonight, thank you very much. Schedule for five five minute rounds. That punch will work right through the guard. Lee gets caught by the straight punch. Slips the punch. Attempts a big hook to the head, but misses. There was a nice exchange. Constantly a moving target. Big left He's got him right here. Oh, he landed another great shot to the body. They're really starting to He's bat. stunned. He's in trouble. Oh, he's getting hit. This fight is dangerously close to being stopped.
Three minutes now to go in this one. Nice. Oh! Swung with a haymaker. Oh, He's got him here. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> yeah, it looks a little wobbly on his feet. Beautiful body shot there, too. He's definitely hurt. Body kick, look at that. Five seconds now to go on the round. Oh, he nailed him! Oh. He's got to be careful here. He's in Can trouble. You believe the it was a huge punch to the body that dropped him, and that led to the TKO finish. Yeah, that couldn't have felt good for the opponent there, Joe. He folded like a lawn chair after that perfectly placed body strike. He tried to put on his best poker face, but you could tell he was really hurt and compromised by that body strike. Let's see it one more time. So a seminal moment for him here tonight as he gets the victory by TKO. Huge result inside the Octagon tonight. All right, here one more time, the veteran voice is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eve Levine has called a stop to this contest at four minutes, 22 seconds of round number four. Declaring the winner by TKO.